It's a beautiful day. Sun is out. It's only about 60 degrees, so it's really nice for walking and exercising. So let's get out on the streets and see what the shopping's like in this fabulous town. Hi everybody, I'm here in downtown San Francisco. Jeff is at a conference, but I get to play all day long. So I said, let's go see what the shopping's like in San Fran. So I headed over, I already hit Neiman Marcus, uh, last call that is, found a great deal on a pair of pretty earrings. I'll show you those later. Uh, I'm going to see what else is here. I do believe they have a Barney's. So I'm gonna head over there and see what I can find but it sure is beautiful here. Let's go walking down the street. The streets are amazing. There's lots of hills here. The people are friendly. There goes some sort of trolley. But that's not the famous trolley. I'll check that out too sometime today. <clears throat> oh, there's a St. John store behind me never been in there. I have to check that out later too. I'm waiting at the light. Now we're crossing. And there is the Marshalls. I also went into Marshalls and I found some cream, some facial cream. So I'll show you that later too. Up there is Macy's. So the shopping's great here because I have a little bit of everything. I mean, there's a Ross Dress for Less store right next to the Armani. There's a Steve Madden store. Oh, there's a salon. I might get my hair done today. Steve Madden. I love him for the shoes. So the weather's been great. It's been like 60 degrees, sunny every single day, and it's gonna be like that all week long. So I'm really lucking out. Having a good time. We went to a restaurant last night called The Water Bar, and that was a nice place. It was right underneath the bridge, amazing views. So I'll have to show you those views from the restaurant. You'll see the bridge all lit up and everything. It's really gorgeous. All right, just walked by Yves Saint Laurent's store. pronounce some of these stores. All Saints San Francisco. That looks like a cool place. Chanel. I know how to pronounce that. Jimmy Choo. Oh, I hit the jackpot. There's La Perla. And I'm passing La Costa. I'm staying out of those stores, I'm telling you. It'll be pretty bad if I go in there with these credit cards. It'll be very, oh, there's Vera Wang. Oh, oh, what she got going on? Oh, nice purses. Let's do some window shopping, shall we? And there's Louis Vuitton across the street. Oh, girl could have some fun around here. Lots of construction going on. I guess they're building new buildings. There's always something new happening in every city. I love the palm trees over there. And there's a really good palm store. Uh -huh. Let me wipe the drool from my mouth. More Louis Vuitton. 
Look at that sweater. Jeff would look great in that. So now I'm on Powell Street and there is a trolley. I don't know if you can see it. The trolley is coming down and you can see, you know, the, the street just goes like up. It's pretty cool. The hills of San Francisco. So the, yeah, the trolley's coming. Christina at Macy's in San guys. Getting help with eyeshadow yep. because, you know, always looking for help. And I just noticed my grays are coming in. I got a <laughs> hair salon. I got this bright but very necessary unflattering light to work with. It's amazing so, in makeup. Yes. Always need one of these. We need it. We got to see what you're doing, I guess. It's, um, we're trying to open up your eye. So we're going to go in with more of a mauve -y tone, okay. which is more like a purple uh, brown underneath. So that's going to give you more um, of depth in your eye, especially bringing out more of your brown eyes. So give you more of a, an awake feel. Okay. Also with more of a beige or a white pink eyeshadow. That's going to put on the eyelid, which is going to open up your eye. Okay. So this is going to be really good just to give you that nice natural look okay. that we're trying to do. Okay. Liner. And because I I usually don't put the liner on the, what do they call it, the waterline? The waterline, yeah. Yeah, so I'm going to give it a try. We're going to give it a try and see how this goes. Right. So we're going to go up. And again, we're just focusing more on the outer. Like that. Okay. Yeah, that, wow. So yeah, with that the waterline, it's not specifically going to stay, stay, but it will give you that definition on your lash line, which a lot of people like. That yeah. way it just gives it that nice. Um, we have like liquid liquid that you can put in there, but eventually it's gonna it's gonna smear. Yeah, you know, that's so. what I was wondering about liquid. But it's, I wouldn't it's specifically put liquid in the waterline. It's gonna irritate your eye. That's what um, I'm and wondering. And it will yeah. smear. And it will smear. And it'll smear. That's okay. why a lot of people do pencil. Okay. okay. Carolina Herrera store, and this is the bracelet I tried on, and it happens to fit perfectly. And then there's the matching necklace and earrings. Just beautiful. So I first hit uh, Marshall's and I got this really cool pouch to put my cell phone in when I go kayaking back at home. So I grabbed that and I got this nice uh, transforming magic cream. It's, I think it's the kind, I hope, it's the kind you put on and then you get that ex the uh, extra firming immediately that happens. We'll see. I hit Macy's and I got my MAC palette. It is burgundy times nine eyeshadow. That, that was done with my demonstration. So now I know how to use it and everything. And I hit Neiman Marcus and found these really pretty earrings. They were, they were only like $30, I think. But my creme de la creme of the day was my gorgeous bracelet. I did treat myself. Ooh, it catches the light. So that's by Christina Herrera, and it's just so pretty. I, I'm wearing it to dinner tonight. I am just so happy. I don't usually spend the good money on jewelry, but this is going to be my memory and my souvenir from my San Francisco vacation. Oh, I also went to McDonald's for lunch for their salad.